this week on the blunders of our bulls. You already know how this works, so let's get into the three games played this week. The Pacers are a decent team that has a lot of potential. The roster has a lot of good players on it, Victor Oladipo, Malcolm Brogdon, and Miles Turner, just to name a few. The Bulls didn't play bad, they just lost to the better team. I mean, Zach Levine had 26 points, Markin had 11, Kobe White only had one, somehow, like, come on now, you're better than this. But, that's besides the point. The Bulls played a decent game, the Pacers just the better team, you know, I'm not mad at it. They played alright, they just didn't win the game. <laughs> Whoa, for a second there, I thought you were just about to upset one of the best teams in the league. But then the second half came around, and as always, the Bulls found a way. I'm not mad at this performance. If we played like this every game, we would have beat half the teams in the league. Zach Levine had 21 points. You know, he's really playing good right now. If he keeps playing this good, you know, I, I really see some good games in our future. You know, the Bulls would have won this game, but the Lakers have these guys, you know, I don't know if you've heard of them, they're called LeBron James and Anthony Davis. You know, the Bulls, you tried your best, and I'm proud, but in the end, they're just a lot better than you. Like, really, really better than you. Yeah. See, guys? Look how fun it is to destroy a team with a couple of young stars that's worse than you in every single way possible. But then you realize that's how the rest of the NBA feels like when they play you. Anyways, this is the best game of basketball you've played since the Grizzlies game. You were solid all around, and that's all you had to be to beat the Hawks. They're, they're pretty easy to beat. I mean, yeah, there's nothing really to say about it. Currently, as of recording this episode, the Bulls are playing the Rockets. This game will be in next week's episode, so for now, all I gotta say is, Houston, please don't go easy on them so I have false hope that they're gonna win. Now the Bulls are 3-6. and six. Not the worst record, but we are 13th in the conference. We just have to play better if we want to move up in the conference. But the schedule for the next two weeks is deadly. We play the Bucks twice, we play the Nets. Bro, that, that's just gonna be a yikes. I just hope we win at least two of those games in the next upcoming week. Do I think we'll win two games? Well, I don't know. We'll just have to find out on the next episode of The Blunders of Our Bulls.